Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to The X-Files Season 2, Episode 5. Very excited to see more conspiracy theories and see this new guy and how I'm just all this like the shadow government stuff. Very intrigued to see. And I'm ready to see more. But before we get into it, please just one more second to remember remind you, go check out Patreon. The link is down below in the description box where you can get this show early and uncut, uncovered reactions with this and all my other YouTube shows, plus Patreon exclusive shows that are only on Patreon and not on YouTube. Other than that, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, without further ado, here we go. Okay, we're in Virginia. I don't know where Pulaski is though, never heard of it. Oh, doggy. Why does this feel like it's not a safe place for this doggy? It doesn't look like anyone should be living here. Uh, this man doesn't look healthy or even alive. What's happening? Uh oh. Who, who's this? Oh, multiple. Can't what? Oh my gosh, aliens? Oh my god. What the fuck? Holy... Oh my god. What's he here? Abducted? Broke? Oh. What the hell? Well, this is them just showing us straight up. Aliens, UFO, damn, what the? Right, now he's here. You've been refusing to take your medicine. I don't like the way it makes me feel. Okay. Right. What's up with Dwayne? Because of your behavior. I know. I know. Because we don't want you to hurt anybody again. Again? You're still hearing voices? Oh. I'm not crazy. Dwayne Barry's not like these other guys. No, everybody here is different. Except you could again. talk to about yourself in third person. Again. Not the best. Again? How many times have the aliens grabbed him? This will make you sleep. You wake up. And we'll see if we didn't let anybody hurt you. Hey, Dwayne. Yeah, don't trust him. Dwayne? Oh, oh, damn. Oh. He went straight for the guard and grabbed the gun. Damn. Oh, well, too late now. Oh, that was... That was a weird hit. Oh, this ass hat. Ooh, are we about to get a wet Mulder? Agent Mulder! Yes, we are. What's up? Oh my. Speed on Mulder. Oh. Right oh my. Whoa. Ah, uh, mmm. <laughs> the guy escaped a mental institution. He's got four people at gunpoint in an office building. Claims he's being controlled by aliens. That's why you. <laughs> and you're so good looking. Damn. Yes, sir. Okay, I got it right here. Oh, this lady. Agent Mulder? Yeah. Missy Castle, negotiation commander. Thanks for coming. This is Agent Kreutzer. Let me show you what we've got. We don't care about him. He's bent on taking the doctor with him to an alien abduction site. Only he can't quite remember oh, where the site is, so he's um, stuck at a travel agency. Oh, okay. Ranting about scoop mark scars on his body, homing devices, and a lot of other nonsense. You're like what? 
Yeah. This whole alien abduction business, which I guess you know something uh, about. Doesn't make a nonsense. Need all the details. What Mr. Barry needs right now is a friend. Someone who appears to understand him and can appeal to his sense of reason. Yeah, you want someone who's going to believe the alien abduction. Anything about his abduction experiences? You really believe in this stuff, Agent Mulder? Even if he doesn't, no you should believe what the hostage is believing to get to know him closer to him. This man is an abductee. I need to know more about him. Yeah, this person. everything. Material's not been made available to us. And nobody's thought to call the hospital for records? Yeah. Look, Agent Mulder, the guy's a psycho. So? You should know his record so I know what he thinks. Believe him. No chance he's not going to kill anybody. We stop to do a Freudian analysis. Next thing we know, we've got four dead hostages. Or maybe you... Or whatever. Yeah? Well, we're just sitting here waiting for uh, travel plans. I think I, I don't know. exactly know where to go, though. You know what I'm going through? You think you know what Dwight Barry's going through? He understands a little bit. You don't know Jack! Oh, God. Hey, what's your name? Mulder? I know the routine. Mm hmm. Honesty, containment, conciliation. Yeah. Was he a former cop or something? They could take somebody out. Nobody's going to try anything, Dwayne. Who is this guy? Yeah. Be He's FBI. Stop. Yeah, why are you lying? Why aren't you telling the truth about everything? I didn't think to mention that. Yeah, it might have been helpful. He's been out of the bureau since nineteen eighty. So he knows the methods. For over a decade, it's beside the point. The point being that the bureau wants to minimize its embarrassment, isn't that mm, it? Yeah. That we can police our own. They would like it done as neatly and cleanly as possible. But it's good wow. to know that info before you go on the phone call with them. Negotiation is a process, Agent Mulder. Well, if you just wanted somebody to come down and read the script, you didn't have to bring me out. Yeah. This method has proven extremely successful in winning the hostage team. When it's someone who doesn't know the method. I'm afraid. And the only way you're going to win his trust is by trying to understand what yeah. he's afraid of. You can't help someone be not afraid unless you understand the fear. Would you like to know what they do to a woman's ovaries? Not particularly. Well, then understand that you might have to alter your approach a little bit here. Yeah. Not every case is exactly the same way that you can do the exact same method. You should know that. Anything I can do. Yeah. What's your name again? Krychek. Krychek. Have you got your notepad? Grande, two percent cappuccino, <laughs> vanilla. <laughs> Krychek is just the little bitch boy, and I love it. Hostage in a travel agency. Well, what they're not telling you is that he's former FBI who also claims to be an alien abductee. Seriously? Yeah. His name's Dwayne Barry. He looks help. I need you to find out what happened. Anything, transcripts from therapy sessions, hypnotic progressions, anything about his abduction experience. Oh. What the? Mulder? The lights just went out here. What the? What happened? What the hell is going on? All the power, the power grid, how? The aliens? Tactical unit, what are you guys up to? Nothing, absolutely nothing, sir. Yep, it's the aliens. That was four gunshots, by the way. So that means he has five left. We've lost our captured line. We have either four or five shots fired. He has four. Five, five, five. An electrical substation blew. Oh. But no power up and down the block. Alien. You didn't believe me, did you? No, I, I, I believe you. I just need to know if anybody's been shot. Yeah. Kimberly? to bleed to death. I guess we're gonna need a doctor. Yeah. Send Scully in. Full ambient hearing loss in this ear. Your sense of balance may be affected slightly, particularly if you have to move quickly or get into a physical situation. Oh, he's going in. Don't you need a doctor, though? I can reveal that you're wired. You really want to do this? Yeah. Your job will be to deliver medical help to the hostage. Anything else is just a bonus. Oh, they're going to pretend to be medical? Risk oh. your own life. Whatever you believe. Don't jump into his delusion. I can't negotiate with him if he thinks I believe him. Right. Why, though? This is Agent. He's a trained medic. He'll work on the hostage. Oh. You're to okay. keep Dwayne Barry talking. Like I said, if he's talking, he's not. I don't get why going into the delusion isn't helping. 
making him trust you would help negotiations, wouldn't it? Were they here, Dwayne? The light. Was that them? Oh. Trying to be a but we lost time. I checked my watch. Isn't that what happens? Time stops. Isn't it? Oh. God. Oh, God. Strobes. All they want to do is just give me more drugs. I hear you, Dwayne. You hear me because I got a gun. No. Fair. <laughs> I believe your story. No, you're Yeah, I knew he wasn't going to have a fake it. This man's going to die unless we get him to a hospital. Why don't you let him go, Dwayne? And he's going to stay as a hostage. You made the right choice. Now we're just going to move him carefully to the door. No. You stay. All he can go. Yeah. But you stay. I'm trading the ball man for you. Yeah, I saw that come from a mile away. Oh, and he's tied up. Now let's see how good a liar you are. He's not a liar. You're telling the truth, Twain. How could you ever know what Dwayne Barry's been through? Trust me, he knows more than you think. You're choosing a dangerous course, Agent Mulder. There are beings, the aren't there? Only way Mulder knows. So creepy. Oh, wow. Oh, the eyes. Good thing. Read his mind. So, like, tele telepathically talking and listening to you. Let's call it mind scan. It's a oh. kind of telepathy. I knew it. Drilled my teeth. Oh. They drilled holes in my oh. dad's teeth! Oh, God. <laughs> Oh no, that's my nightmare. I hate dentists. I hate this teeth stuff. Oh wow, the table. What the hell? Oh, I'm having nightmares about this for sure. Oh god. Oh. 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 Okay. Yeah. Who here can talk to an agent Scully? Ah, Scully. Agent Scully, it's Alex Quartek. Where's Mulder? He traded himself for one of the hostages. What? It's a very Mulder move. Saw it come from a mile away. You sh should have too, Scully. They're working on it. No, you've got to get him out of Why? there now, or he's going to be killed. Why? Because Dwayne Barry is not what Mulder thinks he is. Wait, what? He's not an abductee? What is it? What is it? What is it? Is he actually just a crazy man? She was a... Sometimes, young girls. Oh, what are they doing? Doing tests, you know, tests them. What if this is a case of just he is crazy? He hasn't been abducted or anything until suddenly he's run out of he stopped having his medicine. Now he's seen them again. Sometimes it hurts real bad, and uh. Oh, he's he thinking about his die, sister you know? being hurt, tortured. Let the others go and take me. Oh, they heard you talking like that. They're going to have your ass. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care about that, Dwayne. He just wants to know more. He really believes him. No, I don't think you understand what I'm telling you. I just flew well, down here from Washington. We've got a situation in progress. All right, well, then... Listen to her. You are. Calm down, Scully. Don't tell me to calm down. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to calm down yeah. until I can talk to someone yeah, who listens to what I'm get, saying. Get help. Help Mulder out. 
This man who claims to be under the control of aliens, his his mental health history describes a rare state of psychosis. What does that mean? As you can see from his words, in 1982, Dwayne Berry was shot in the line of duty. Oh. A bullet piercing his bilateral frontal lobes. Oh. Left him nearly incapable of functioning in society. So he was shot in the brain. He destroyed the moral center of his brain. Oh. Now, almost a hundred years ago, there was a famous case. A man named Gage had a blasting rod pierce the same region. Ooh. And what affected He became a pathological liar suffering from uh, severe delusions his behavior was characterized as bizarre so and violent. he's lied he's lying but he believes it so much well if this is true he's got your former partner completely fooled yeah is there a way that i can reach him with this information yes there is they're even in on it sometimes right there in the room when they come they work together i don't know about that that's, that sounds fake to me. The government and the aliens working together. Yeah, this is where I'd be like, uh, question you a bit. Where it first started, where they first came and got me. Where is that? If you can't remember where you abducted, maybe that means they weren't. How do they find you each time? They implant. Gun. That's what that scar is. It's the brain. Yeah. Now you have to work towards resolving this. Now you have his trust. You have to try and negotiate with him. Yeah. HRT is moving into position, and unless you can get him to free the hostages, they are going to execute a tactical plan. Oh no. The women are of no consequence to you. Yeah, it's true. You only need the doctor and him. Okay, but he stays. Fair. Go on, get out of here. Go down. Get up. Come on, go, go, go. <clears throat> I just want to say that I believe you. Okay. Well, I don't know why you had to stop and say that. Gotcha, number one. We're gonna need transportation. What do you want, Dwayne? You bet we did, Dwayne. When you can't leave here if you don't know where you want to go. Oh. Boy, what? Come here. Oh, he's. Hold your fire. You lost your line. Oh, he moved him. Why, Mulder? I had to earn your trust. Now, there's something I gotta know. Are you making any of this up? Oh, don't piss him off. Don't make him go crazy. God, he's about to snap. You, uh, call him the wing Barry a liar now? Oh, God. Why would you do this, Mulder? You think I'll make it all up? No, I don't. I'm sorry. Mm, too late now. You said it. You can't take it back. When you let the women leave, you left the door unlocked. Uh. Go unlock the door. Shoot. If you're gonna do it, do it now. It looks like aliens to him, but it's not. Is that what maybe he saw when he got shot in the head before? And it made him think it was aliens and keeps thinking it's happening? You okay, Mulder? It hit a lot of nerve. Yeah. The abduction, the girls in there. It's just that boy. I believe them. I don't think I do, honestly. Sometimes when you want to believe so badly, you end up looking too hard. Just like he did. He believed so hard, he made it true to himself. Whatever your impression of the way it was handled. I didn't get to thank you for going out there and putting it on the line. That's good, thanking him. Even if you didn't agree with his methods, he did I a good job. Maybe you called me down here to chew me out. <laughs> Shot by his own weapon in a drug stakeout. What? 
left for dead in the woods. How? He was never the same. Lost everything. Wife, kids. Maybe house. he was abducted. Time, dread, insanity. I actually called you down here for another reason, Agent Mulder. Why? The surgeon found several pieces of metal in his gums. Oh. In the sinus cavity. Oh my. And one in the abdomen. <gasps> I've been checking. He was. Want to know? And there were tiny drill holes in his left and. Oh. A dentist who examined them said they could not have been done with any of the current equipment in use. Oh. Not without chipping or damaging the tooth. Anyway. Oh, this is I something real. This whole time, Dwayne. Sorry, I didn't believe you. Nice of this lady to tell the truth and let it let him know. She knew. He would want to know. What is it? This could just be a piece of shrapnel. Dwayne Barry did a tour of duty in Vietnam. Mm. It's right where he said it would be Scully, along with the ones in his gums and his sinus. Yeah, that's a little suspicious. The gums is the weird one. That would mean Dwayne Barry's telling the truth. Yep. Or some version of the truth. Could be that too. Something similar. Look, I'll I'll take this down to ballistics. We can have this cleared up in a second. Just don't get it taken from you. Don't lose it. It'd be white hot when it entered the body. That would make sense. But look at this. What? These small markings. Like serial mark? This square we're looking at is only 10 microns across. Strange. Weird. It's like a barcode. Yes, that's what I thought. Barcode. Who? The days of writing checks for groceries. Such a weird thing. She's gonna scan it, see what happens. She's curious. Oh. Oh my. Oh. That's weird. Uh, something weird there. Oh, he's about to be abducted again. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. Bye bye, Dwayne. Mm, it's creepy. So maybe there will government. What if government is working with aliens? Oh, part of government, the smoker guy. Or oh, there are aliens in the government. So no security here? Oh, there we go. Not good security though. Yeah, really bad guys. Pay attention, to do your job, not on the phone. What the hell is this thing, Mulder? It's almost as if... It's a serial It's almost as if attack. somebody was using it to catalog. Him. Yeah, are they cataloging people, taking them? Oh god, are they here? Is he here? Don't take, don't hunt Scully. Oh god. Oh god. <gasps> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. To be, or for us to be continued in there. Scully, Scully, don't hurt Scully. Don't hurt Scully. That's like rule number one. Oh. This one intrigues me. The whole episode itself was like, okay, pretty good. And then by the end, I'm like, oh, this is amazing. Once we learn that he was alien, taken by aliens. He was taken away and drilled in his mouth holes and things put inside of him, including this little metal thing that's a barcode. So like, are aliens cataloging humans? Taking them, putting them, taking like count of them? Is that what's happening? Like, or he's like a research experiment and taking catalog of like 
they're doing different people from across the planet to research on put a plant in and put stuff inside and then put them back into life and like watch and listen and then Scully figures that out and is he actually Dwayne goes to get them not the aliens so why does how did Dwayne know she was there how did he even know she was there was it the aliens that abducted him and was like go get her programmed him go after where the chip is So intriguing, so intriguing. And if everything, if Dwayne was telling, telling the truth, that means he did see girls, which could be including Mulder's sister, don't know. Also including that there were government people there. We don't know 100% of it, we don't know if 100% of it is true, but the fact that we know that some of it is true means other parts could be true too. And what if it's like, Maybe not even, like, the government's working with the aliens. Maybe some of the government are aliens. And they're, work and they're working on from the inside out. From the inside, not... Ooh, of the government. Like, maybe Smoker Guy. They don't want Mulder looking into it and finding things they don't want. I don't know. Ooh, I'm intrigued to the next one and see what happens. They better save Scully. No harm must ever come to Scully. That is just facts of life. Oh. <sighs> Yes, we'll see. Alright, so thank you guys for watching with me. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out Patreon and the link down below in the description box. And have a great day, okay? I'll see you guys next time. Bye.